Hey, uh, this is Helena with uh, not a shiny shove, more of an invitation slash a little bit of education. Um, part of helping you shine really is to ensure that people feel very peaceful um, in an energized and excited way if that's how you do peace or calm and, and serene way if that's how you do it. You know, we all do peaceful in our own little ways. Now, here's the thing. Today, 21st of November, for the last 43 years, I think my maths is right, um, it started late in the 70s. World Hello Day actually ar arose simply from um, uh, two university students who basically spent pretty much all their money on postage sending out letters to uh, hellos to world leaders across the globe. Now, early 70s, 73 it was, I think, um, Brian and Michael McCormick actually took on the challenge or thought to, uh, to themselves, how do we help be uh, the world be at peace, uh, bearing in mind the difficulties that were going on, all the, the, you know, the war zones that are still going on in today's day and age. It was really a call to the leaders of the world, um, those who are in the public eye, to reach out and say hello. Because here's the thing, and this is what they really harness the power of and what I think has kept this tradition going for as long as it has. At the end of the day, all communication is personal. All communication starts with a hello. So how how would it be if we all just started to say hello? Not just to friends, to family, but by all means, reach out to those. But also to strangers. Just saying hello can make a massive difference. Um, I know for a fact that, um, you know, sort of my collaboration partner, Kelly, um, she and her husband, Rich, uh, every December do go out and actively go out into the community and say hello to homeless people. For example, our job as people who can lead, who are role models, and just as human beings, is really to start that process of saying hello, because who knows where a hello can go? Who knows how far that hello actually reaches somebody else? So, 21st of uh, November, don't know where you are in the time zone, but if you haven't squeezed in 10 hellos in whatever language you choose to do that, um, please go and say hello, because this really is about starting or reminding us that peace absolutely starts when we're in personal communication with each other. Many blessings, have a brilliant and wonderful day, and I will catch you again tomorrow with a shiny shove.